So then that would then take another number out. So so then that would be two sets of teachers who would would have been leaving the profession anyway. So then it lessens the burden or, or it lessens the hit, uh, so to speak, on teachers to say that teachers who are qualified would have to be asked to leave. Nonetheless, that would not cover the number of teachers that they expect would need to leave you know, to, based on the enrollment. So there may be one or two teachers who are qualified, but who do not have the necessary required workload or teaching load to be able to remain. And so um, there might be two persons who would probably have to exit the school system. So we're, we're looking at 17 teachers in total, and this would probably be the process of elimination, correct? No, that is the issue because we were not given a number to say that it was 17. We were not told whether it was 17, 12, 10. No number was given to us. So we cannot see how many of those persons are the ones affected with regards to licensing. It, it, it sounds like it's about five or seven of them. Another few, two or four of them in terms of retirement age, and then another two we know who are qualified, but because of the teaching load would not be able to remain. And of those two, it seems as though one would be offered a position by the ministry somewhere else, and then the ministry would be trying to see, they have reached out to box to see which schools are in need of teachers so that those teachers then, those additional teachers who would need to be displaced then would be sent over to those schools who need teachers. So based on what was sent to us, it would seem that there would be no teachers then who would be, they just put on the system just like that.